Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. So today we're doing a three year review on the Piranha Pine, also known as the Brazilian Pine. And as you can see, these things have just exploded. The trees are now in 15 litre buckets, so they are taking up quite a lot of soil now. I'm pretty sure that their root balls have already used all the soil in there, so they will need repotting in the, in the spring. Uh, I don't know if you've seen blue powder on the trees. That's just a bit of sulfur powder, just to prevent any mold or rot setting in. So when I bought these trees guys, they was a one year old seedling each. And I've now had them three years, so they'll be four years old now. And believe it or not, this monkey puzzle, which is next to them, is actually a year older than they are. So it just shows how much quicker growing the piranha pine is to its very closely related cousin. So you've just seen the trunks of the trees and uh, here's the leaves. You can see the difference quite clearly. The monkey puzzle is much darker, smaller leaved. Now last winter these trees did survive some very cold temperatures down to minus seven. They also survived weeks of prolonged snow, undamaged. You're probably wondering where the fourth tree is though if you've seen the past two videos. So the fourth tree wasn't killed in the winter cold, it was actually before that when it first happened. A caterpillar has been eating this tree between the months of September and November 2017. It wasn't until November I found a caterpillar which I was surprised to see was still active during the winter. It decimated the tree and then the winter cold came and then the hottest summer on record came and it just hasn't had the chance to come back unfortunately. Now I was very lucky to get the chance to grow this tree. It is critically endangered which means it's one step away from being extinct in the wild. Please remember guys you can all do your bit for conservation. If you're lucky enough to get the chance to grow this tree I urge you to do so. Together we can stop them from becoming extinct.